Okay, I'm going to be doing the prone progression and wall exercises, which can be used to help stabilize the musculature surrounding the scapula. And this has research has indicated that this can be used for um, lateral epicondylysia. So you're going to have your patient lying prone, and you'll have her bring their hands behind their head. And you're just going to have them be lifting up with their elbows. And you want to make sure that they're using their mid and lower traps. So you can give them some tactile cues here. And they want to inhibit the upper trap. So there. And then once they get through that, which you can have them do three sets of ten, you can have them progress into where they're going to bring their arms out like this. And they're going to be coming up with their elbows again here. So still providing tactile cues. Three sets of ten of that. And the next progression, you're going to have them bring their arms out to their side, thumb up, and you're going to have them do the same thing. And then after they progress through that, you can have them go to standing against the wall. And they're going to have their arms up at 90 here and then raise, raising up against the wall just like this and keeping their scapula and arms against the wall. And you can also have them do three sets of 10 with this.